Music Mix Mobile typically is a music for a broadcast company. We do a lot of, um, of the, the higher profile music shows, the Grammy Awards, the Country Music Awards, uh, the Tonys, uh, iHeart Music Radio Festivals, um, and we have become very proficient at, at music for television. The project du jour for today is the Grateful Dead's 50th uh, final shows in Santa Clara and Chicago. Uh, we uh, moved the truck down here to Santa Clara to Levi Stadium, uh, set it up and did some rehearsals with them again and tonight is our first show for the Grateful Dead. The Eclipse truck, which is our flagship truck, is a, uh, uh, an extreme powerhouse. Uh, this truck is capable of 192 channels uh, of in and out um, at 96K. It's probably one of the largest capacity music trucks that are built in the market. Over the last years, um, technology and the technical advances have fueled artists just adding more and more things and, and, and having more and more expectations from their shows. For instance, we're looking at 160 plus inputs coming from the arena, which have to be fed into the music truck and be active and available at any point in time. Technology changes, we change. Um, it's all just a, a complete adaption. The biggest unique requirement about the Grateful Dead uh, 50th uh, shows are that they wanted to track these all at 96K. Um, 96K is a uh, higher sample rate that requires additional interfaces and requires additional hard drives. It just ups the, the, uh, the equipment count um, by a bit more. Now we're recording on Thunderbolt technology rather than, than recording on, on uh, other technology that we were using like, like mini SAS um, or USB 3.0. Uh, it becomes a, uh, a whole new ball game and you have to think about it in a completely different way because the hardware requirements just push the, uh, the, the, the boundaries of what um, the truck can do. Thunderbolt technology is, is a godsend for, uh, for us and for the audio industry. It has just become um, a, a, a must-have on any device that we buy that's going to be the storage and or uh, chassis for connectivity within our trucks. Sonnet technology has always been a, a big part of, of our recording scheme. In the recorder racks, we have two uh, Mac Pro 6-core 3.5 gigahertz uh, cylinder Mac Pros. These are all attached to Sonnet Echo Express 3R chassis that house uh, 3HDX Avid uh, DSP I.O. cards each, which are attached to three MATI I.O.s and allow us to do 192 in and 192 out at 96K. We have a third recorder system that's running on a MacBook Pro, which allows us to, uh, to utilize, again, uh, all the Thunderbolt technology. We have a, uh, an Echo Express 3R, again, with three HDX cards inside that. In the center rack in Eclipse Engineering, we have the X Mac Pro server, which uh, also houses a 3.5 gigahertz cylinder Mac Pro. We also have a Rack Mac Mini, which contains two Mac Minis, which are our backup computers should uh, any computer in the recording systems fail. And for video recording, we have an Apple MacBook Pro attached to a Echo Express SE2, housing a Black Magic card that records ProRes LT files for playback inside of the truck. A couple of features that we love about the Sonic product are its ruggedness, the way it's been way it's built, and its quietness. They come out of the truck working and solid every time. And as a quiet product, we've had to use it in situations where the engineer is sitting within a foot of the recording system. We don't have another room to record in as an engineering room. We have to have quiet product. And these are some of the quietest products that we've ever used as far as expansion chassis go. Sonnet has become an integral part of, of equipment that Music Mix Mobile uses. We are comfortable with it. We love the way that the product works, the dependability. We've had zero issues with the product as it goes along, and it is just going to be a mainstay in our, in our equipment stable for a very, very, very long time. <laughs>